The father of the side and Tyler this side. <laughs> Face the people. Bend down and try to put your face between your knees. <laughs> Can you go low? Now the Bible said, can you win? Can you bend down to the ground and put his place between his knees? Okay, thank you. Now, Mother, tell me something. How do you feel? I said at the beginning, but no, can you tie it? What was it true? The Bible said he bent down and put his face between his knees. Which basically means that he went into, it wasn't easy. This is, I mean, Tyler is flexible. The father is not so flexible. Thank you. I just wanted to demonstrate something he put his face between his knees. And according to the Hebrew culture, at that time, a woman would give birth that way. It's a birthing prayer, a birthing position. It was in deep intercession. Because God said, go and tell Ahab, if you receive a word from God, to tell somebody today, after you decree, there will be no rain upon the land. And suddenly, now the word of the Lord come to you and said, go and present yourself to Ahab and tell him, listen, I will send rain upon the land. Then he had the audacity to go and tell him and said, listen, go to Jezreel. So that the rain could not stop you. Let me say something. You cannot pray on a low level. You have to go to a higher level. You cannot pray in a normal position. The Bible said he went to Mount Carmel, to the top of the mountain. When I was in Israel, we went to Mount Carmel. Let me say to you, beloved, you cannot pray on an earthly level. You have to change gears and go into a supernatural level. Amen. We're talking tonight about speed, supernatural speed. I will go immediately to verse 44. He said, The seventh time the servant reported a cloud as small as a man's hand is rising from the sea. So Elijah said, Go and tell Ahab, hey, hitch up your chariot, go down before the rain stop you. Meanwhile, the sky grew black with cloud, the wind rose heavy, and rain came on, and Ahab rode off to Jezreel. Now, the crutch of the supernatural speed, the Bible said, the power of the Lord came upon Elijah and tucking his, his cloak into his belt, he ran ahead of Ahab all the way to Jezreel. He went ahead. You cannot run ahead of somebody else. He wasn't a Train athlete, a long distance athlete. No, he was just a normal man. He wasn't trained in athletics. He was just a simple proper. But the Bible said he ran, and according to some, it is 70 kilometers or 70 miles. 
that you had to run. And he outran the chariot of air. Speed is involved. But you can't have speed unless you be empowered by the Holy Ghost. I said you cannot have speed unless you empowered by the Holy Ghost. Amen. The Spirit of the Lord wants to do something in your life. Here. He wants to bring us to a place what we couldn't do for the last 24, 5, 6 years. God wants us to do in one year very speed. Amen. I said very speed. Amen. What you were not able to do all your life. God wants to increase. He wants to accelerate you. Because the time and the season for his supernatural power and manifestation is here.
will give a trembling in the atmosphere. I see somebody is not even getting excited. Mm. It means you break through the sound barrier. Amen. I said you break through the sound barrier. When speak is your portion, in a I said in a by sound that you've been around, they will be looking for you and you will be gone. I prophesy supernatural speed will come upon you and there will be a sound of breaking. I believe system like communism, 
is a belief system and it falls its way wherever it goes. We know about the pain of holes. Now the pain holes, we will find out in the original Greek is not pain. It is the Greek word is claws. Which means green. What belief system have green behind it? Islam. Islam. It's a belief system. It forces way. We heard the other day, I can't remember where it was, again, Christians have been murdered, their heads chopped off. No, don't speak about it because it's hate speak. No, we have to speak the truth. Amen. Yes. We cannot be silent. If I remain silent, it means I agree. And I do not agree. So Hulsa speaks of a belief system, a power system that will be able to enforce its way in the atmosphere. So what is the Lord saying? He said, listen, a cloud will fall. And out of that cloud, cherub shall be as a wind wind, his horses are swifter than an eagle, supernatural speed. Swifter than an eagle, one of the fastest birds you can get when it comes down to take his prey, when his eye is upon the prey, he goes straight before the prey can, can move, he already taking the prey up into the air. But he said, something will happen, I will ignite you, I will be, you will be like a whirlwind, the horses will be swooped than an eagle. I release over your life every place where you go every place where God has planted you you will be swifter than an eagle your life will produce I said you will dominate Oh, no, 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 no,
eagle is in the sky. Let me tell you to my beloved, the God that we serve is going to do something supernatural. You will see the hand of God. I said I prophesy. 2020. I said 2020. Isaiah 
62 verse 10 said, go through, go through the gates. Prepare ye the way of the people. Cast up, cast up the highway. Gather out the stones. Look up and stand for the people. Go through the gate. Tonight you're not going to go through the gate in a normal way. Tonight I decree and I declare you will go through in a supernatural way.
Just lift your hands. Just lift your hands. Anybody that feel fire in his body, just raise your hand. Your right hand, just lift it up. Is there somebody that feel fire? Because God is releasing right now fire. You thought it is gone, but it's coming back. I said it's coming back. By fire and by force. The power of God is activated and released. The power of God is activated and released. Fire! Who's that person? Just come. Raise your hand. Some of you have experienced the fire in your belly, you feel it, felt it in your hands. Some of you, it was so strong, but it, it went away. Just come to the front. Just come to the front. We're going to release a new fire. 2020, 2020. The fire of revival. The fire of revival. There's power in this place. There's power in this place. Describe 
what God is going to do in your life and in your family. Receive it now.
Hallelujah. Father, we give you all the praise and all the glory. Just lift your hands and worship him. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Just lift your hands.
come during 2019. I want you to come. Because God set you up for the next level. It's like a birthing that took place in your life. A birthing of a new thing. God is going to do a new thing. Oh, show my sister, this come. Whatever you've been through in 2019, Rabba Sandaria Tana Ramanda Rabba Kurubunda Ria Satana Ramanda.